Well, uh, let's see. I'm afraid let's, to see. Let's see. I'm afraid to see. Oh my god! Yo! What is this? When did you buy like, that? I didn't buy this! What the heck is this? Looks like. Oh my gosh, it almost looks like a beer dispenser, like where you put the drinks in. It's got Pepsi. Ooh. Yeah, it's got Pepsi. <laughs> oh, <I have> Pepsi. <laughs> Does it even work? Well, that one works. Well, that's empty too. So. So. That button that don't work. Button don't even work. Why, why do you have this? Why do I have this? Yeah. This is what she said Ron dropped off earlier. Oh, that's what Ron dropped off. This wasn't in here earlier today. Why? why? I mean, we've been working on this freaking shop for so long here. Right? I mean, look how beautiful it looks. We've got like. our mascot Dixie Chopper here. <laughs> you know? The <laughs> mascot. I mean, yeah. I, might, I might put this up on the wall. No, something. no, it's the main attraction. The main attraction. I mean, look at this shop. You and I have been working our asses off on here, and he brings this piece of crap here. Oh. Dude, it's from the 70s. It looks like it's from the 70s. I should kick it over. Don't. What do you think, Bob? Should we put it in the middle of the thing and kick, kick it, it over? over? No, he's not here to watch it. He That's true. Cry. Maybe when he's here, I'll kick it over. We can, yeah. So he can, sit, he can sit there and get mad at me for spending business money on things, and you know, it's, it's not even stable. Dude, this... Wow. So how do you even fill the thing with beer? Like, like we gotta see if this thing works. I think like, you have to open like the front or something. It's like a little fridge. I see this and I wanna say Johnny Five is alive. He yeah. I mean, is. So, look at the dude moving. Oh, look at that. Be careful. Look, it's Whoa. a cabinet. That's a cabinet. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Oh. What's empty? He didn't even fill it. So he brings over an empty vending machine, right? Oh, it's starting to get cold. Oh yeah, let's let's bring let's spend business money on this. I'm Mr. Perfect. Yeah. I'm Ron. I'm Mr. Perfect. I'm Ron. Spending business money on stuff. stuff. Well, let's see if it works. Let's see what yeah, right? Uh, let's go in the in the in the here where there's actually beer. I mean, the car didn't work, so if this works, I mean it's kinda What are you talking about? <laughs> let's go. <laughs> and works. I want to know something. <laughs> Emma says black truck. Ron doesn't have a black truck. You have a black I truck. I do have a black truck. And you have the code to the door. I have a thumbprint to the door. You have a thumbprint to the door. I do. She also said... You have said, a black truck. Oh, whoa, whoa. Go also, ahead. Go ahead, Bob. She said there was someone else that she didn't recognize. She would recognize me. Emma, were you close enough to see who it was? Um, I couldn't see... What, it, was like, it was like a shadow in the car because he didn't come out of the car. Like, he stayed in the car. Couldn't have been me. My thumbprint Bob, opens the door. You got the code. Too. I forget the code. Yeah, yeah. that's that's subjective. Well, that's, you so you're gonna bring things in here with Ron. I would love to bring things in here with Ron. Unfortunately, I was cleaning my garage and would put it in my garage over yours, if I had this. Bob, I would are you sure you're not messing with me, man? Because we're supposed to go prank Ron. I need you on my side, man. I'm, let's see if it works first. Yeah. I don't even know how to do it. Wait, you had this. You have to take right? off the fridge there thing, you. and then you put it in there. Loading tips. No, oh, so you can do bottles and cans. It shows you how. Well, all right. Put one in. Which one is it? I have no clue. Okay. We'll have to, we'll have to guess. So it's not light here. See if it's Coors Light. <laughs> nope. I'm guessing not. I think it's the first one. Oh, oh now that one works. Maybe it just had to warm up because it's from 1980. I mean, yeah. <laughs> oh! That's not Pepsi. <laughs> well, Ron, you could at least. Right? Well, hey. Geez. I mean, he could have at least, at least he could have put beer in it. You know? Yeah. At least put a second one in there. Yeah, just like. How just did you like open them. this? Right here, the hinge. And then it, it just, I just laid it in here. Toward the back. There you go. Now, I don't know if I think it. I don't know. Wait, oh, yeah, I guess you're good. I have no clue. I have no clue either. So it's the first one. We know it's the first one. Oh, well, he could have shut up here. Ah, check it out. Beers. All right, open Dude. yours up. Let's do a cheers, man. Cheers. To two beers. To two beers, to two and beers. then Ron spending more business. Chase money. up your beer, though. 
I'm, I'm afraid to know what he spent on this thing. Well, if they labeled it vintage from an antique store, almost as much as you spent on the car. And, and, Ron, and Ron is real, he loves them antiques. He loves them estate sales. He loves, I mean, this is what Ron does though. You know, everybody looks at him as, as Mr. Perfect. And, oh, he, you know, we need to mm. prove the Larry's Lounge. I think that's what this prank's going to be about. Is proving the Larry's Lounge that we are loyal. And obviously those pranks that came out that were done to him weren't us. And, and that's obvious. So like, right. I'm thinking we prank Ron and then hopefully we'll take a ride over there. Well, we'll, been, we'll just show up, you know? Yeah, I've been prank waiting like two months or more to prank Ron here. Well, I've been waiting. I got a good one lined up. All right, so you're ready. I'm right? ready. All right, let me go grab something out of my truck. Okay. I'm ready also. Okay. All right, so let me go get that in my truck. All right. I'm thinking we need to get rid of this thing. It don't go right with the shot. You know where it goes? In my garage. It goes in perfect garage? in my garage. No, in my room. In, not in your room? <laughs> You're not old enough to have anything but Pepsi. I'm going to go get this thing. Okay. Yeah, we'll get that. So what do you think about the look? Love it. It's so cool. It looks way better than the it old does, look. It does, doesn't it? Yeah, it's very, it's very nice. Very nice. It reminds me of the middle of nowhere, Texas. There's a little roadside stand that you pull up on. Oh. They got the smoker going out back and the yes. big barbecue sign, right? Isn't that what? Yeah. Yeah. And then it's like super underpriced. Yes. Because it's just like in the middle of nowhere and they're just trying to make money. Yes. And now your dad picked this all out. So yeah, his I think it HGTV nice. show is coming out soon because he does a wonderful interior decorator. <laughs> but it did. It turned out really nice. It, it looks like a really professional shop now. Yeah. It Except looks for the old... Wherever Whatever that, that is. Yeah. It, it looks way better than it did before because now it looks more like a shop because before it just looked like walls and It looks just like walls. Yes. Now walls it actually and looks, stuff. I mean, look, he's got the ones on display right behind us and... No, the, the shop really came it out came good. really nice. The shop really yeah. came out good. Um, so about, about when we go to his house. Right. When we pull up, you're going to go in first. Go in where? You're gonna have in to go. House? You're gonna knock on the door and everything. Okay. You're gonna have to distract them for a little while. Sure, I can do that. All right. <laughs> yep. Making up an excuse, to, you know, tell Plenty. him that. Plenty. Tell him that I'm in the truck talking to a customer or something, if he asks even. Right. And then I need to go plan a couple things, and I'll be in. Okay. And and I think we should confront him about the whole freaking kicking the smoker thing over. I haven't talked to him since. I mean, I yeah. You I know. I don't. Uh, I don't like. That he kicked over. I don't care if it's a trade-in or not. That's that's product for you guys. It's exactly. Yes. It's product and and it's, and it's not for nothing. We were in the middle of renovating here, and he kicked over. What if it made a mess in here? What if it, you know? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. No, we were. No, I don't like that. No, it it wasn't right. What he did. Right. He needs to apologize. I agree. You know. I agree. Because I'll kick over that thing. I don't care what that thing. It's vintage. It's it's cool looking, but I'll kick it over in front of him. It just doesn't fit right now. It doesn't, it doesn't fit. I mean, we, we changed. You, you changed everything in here. It doesn't even match color wise. It's, it's not even the right match. scheme. It needs to be painted. It needs something if it's yeah. gonna stay. Yeah. I mean, come on. So, um, what'd you get? You know the deal. What'd you get? You'll see. Why does it look like something that's gonna float on water? You'll see. <laughs>